Subsea engineering is aimed at graduate engineers who have an interest in subsea industry. We have a, a range of um, distance learning students who are actually already employed in the subsea industry and they do the course on a part-time basis. And we also have a full-time cohort who are on campus and attending lectures on a daily basis. Students come from all over the world to study uh, subsea engineering at Aberdeen. We get a lot of local mechanical and civil engineering students, but also there are students who have studied more diverse engineering applications like chemical engineering, and there are some electrical engineers and other specialist topics like naval architecture have all uh, applied and successfully completed the programme. I studied electrical and electronics engineering. I studied ocean engineering. I was in full-time employment with the Royal Air Force at the time. Uh, and I was an instructor on fast jet tornadoes. I was fortunate enough to do an internship with a subsea engineering company, Tilon Subsea, back in Nigeria. And it was very interesting. For six months, I was exposed to a typical subsea environment. I was fortunate also to talk with an alumni and he broke it down for me and explained what I was going to gain. And it sounded like a really wonderful offer. Uh, I was interested in oil and gas uh, and subsea engineering was kind of at the pinnacle, if you like, of, uh, of technology uh, and it looked like the most challenging field, so that's why I chose it. Aberdeen is a global centre of excellence in the subsea arena because a lot of the technology and the research is driven from the North Sea expertise, uh, which makes it a very good place to have connections between academia and industry. We have uh, fantastic links with the industry, starting from shaping our curriculum and, and um, support of the Industrial Advisory Board, delivering the material, specialised material as part of the curriculum, uh, delivering guest lectures to complement the curriculum. We also have companies who support us through providing the scholarship for our students. The final element of the course is a 12-week individual project which takes place over the summer. It enables the students to investigate uh, an element of subsea engineering which is particularly of interest to them, either working in our fluids lab or in our geotechnics lab, and also involved with projects with um, companies in the local area. My favourite part is when we are learning new software, such as Flexcom or Pipesim, and also when we doing a group projects, working together with fellow students from countries all over the world. Highlight has been going on industry visits. It was very exciting to actually see proper engineers at work and see all the things we've learned about in class. It was really, really exciting. For me, having not worked in oil and gas before, having come from a very different background, um, it, it, was a, it was a great stepping stone into the industry and it gave me a really broad knowledge of what the industry was about and, and it helped me to choose which specialisation I wanted to go into. Um, that's kind of how I got to know about Acker Solutions actually, it was through the course because uh, one of our engineers here gave a presentation uh, during the MSc uh, which interested me in subsea control systems. It worked out really well, yeah, I'm here. <laughs> I would love to go into proper research, especially since exploration is moving into like deeper areas and unreachable areas. I would love to research and help prefer solutions to questions that are being raised. <laughs>